Excessive rain and flooded roads triggering evacuations and an emergency order in the Flathead Valley. The hardest hit area right now, Highway 2 and other roads between Columbia Falls and Hungry Horse. And with recent snow, warmer temperatures and more rain head our way. The Flathead County Board of Commissioners is officially declaring a state of emergency. Officials are also ordering new evacuations for residents along North Hilltop Road. Dominic Vidiello brings us more on the situation in the Flathead Valley. Across the Flathead, heavy rainfall is taking over roadways, eroding riverbanks, and flooding homes. In Kalispell, record-breaking rainfall with over 2 inches in 24 hours. The old record set in 1973 with less than an inch. Officials issued evacuation orders for low-lying areas in Columbia Falls. And Red Cross opened a shelter at the Columbia Falls High School for anyone displaced by flooding. Flathead County is 5,200 square miles, and we have affected areas pretty much scattered from the north end of this county all the way to the south end. We are working with our local fire departments, uh, sheriff's department, OES, uh, and multiple other agencies, search and rescue, to have a good response uh, as we monitor we work through this scenario. You can see here footage from our NBC Montana Sky Team. The sheer volume of water flooding areas of Columbia Falls. Flathead River levels are now over 14 and a half feet. The National Weather Service is projecting levels to rise to 15. Officials are urging travelers to avoid all roadways covered with water. Identifying areas that could become problematic. Um, identifying roads that are getting undercut, culverts that are plugged. Um, so that's really the, the, the push right now. You've got to really use some caution. Officials are expecting several more roadways to close, but can't predict which ones. We will continue to update you on these changing conditions and where to get sandbags in the flathead at NBCMontana.com. Officials say the next challenge will be rising temperatures that increase snowmelt and runoff. Those conditions expected by the end of the week. Reporting in the Flathead Valley, Dominic Vidiello, NBC Montana.